Good morning, everybody. It is our last day, and we are just heading to the reception to give the mobility scooter back. I'm riding around with Nevaeh on my Nikos Air Pram. It's all folded for the minibus, and we're going to go to the little shop to see if we can get some gifts that we actually forgot to get yesterday. Well, the wind that we forgot, we thought the shops would still be open and they closed. So, away we go. Hang on a minute, isn't that reverse? Yeah, you can pull it up to go that Oh, way. right, okay. Uh, well, isn't that swanky? I don't even know how to use this. He so knows how to use it better than you me. You can reverse it with this one and go Oh, uh, so if, you, if you're left handed yes. But I'm going to use the right hand because of the baby. Right, I'll let you vlog. <laughs> Oh, bag's breaking. Oh, you might have to put the bag on. No, it's alright, I've got it. Hey, Daddy, let's go. <laughs> Hello, Daddy. Hello, everybody. <laughs> She's now got the baby on my shoulders. That shot was a bit pricey, wasn't it? Six pounds. Saying that, two of it, three of them were presents, so I think that's why. But um, it comes to seven pounds and I only bought a packet of fudge, two bars of rock and two chocolate bars. <laughs> <laughs> oh yeah, you've got two frozen drinks actually, yeah. That's probably where they're coming to it. But yeah, the scooter's yeah, gone back. Okay. So now yeah. the baby is using me as a chariot. Yeah. I should have really let her walk to wear herself out a bit before the minibus. But we wouldn't get back until the minibus was arriving at that rate. <laughs> so, um, chariot it is. I have absolutely damaged my gallbladder. Bubba. We decided to get takeout last night because everybody was hungry at like 10 o'clock. We got a cheese garlic pizza and I knew I shouldn't have ate it back then, but I did. And now, where is your chocolate? It's on a hand. Oh. <laughs> Chocolate, come on then, eat your chocolate. I knew then, I'd, oh. There it goes. I knew then, I'd end up in agony. And I did, middle of the night, started. And all morning, it started as well. Okay, you've got another one. We'll have it when we get back to the van. Oh, baby cake. Matthew being a good boy, tying his nanny's laces. Oh, I them all week. Oh, <laughs> The chest's killing, isn't it? <gasps> You're always guaranteed. The last day of holiday, the sun starts cracking the flags and Sue's chest always kicks off. She got COPD and all night... It starts about 7 o'clock, didn't it? The chest starts there and then she was starting to cough and then all night long, it's been kicking off. So she'll be sick now for the next couple of days, no doubt. Have you got your neb and all that with you or is that in the house? It's broke. It's broke? Yeah, I can't get the name. The, you know, the name. Um, COPD nurse. Yeah. Yeah, hopefully you know. That's the one I bought, wasn't it? Hmm. We've decided since we've got about 45 minutes before the minibus is going to come and get us, we're going to go to the park. We're going to go take the kids to have a little bit of fun. There's a park behind them fences and we don't know how to get in. That park behind them fences is the park that we walk the dot. Hang on, which way have we? What? Ow! After all of this time, have we come the wrong way? <laughs> um, but that park behind that fence is the park that we used to walk the dog in last year. Mm. But yeah, um, we're going to the park. Let's see. Say hi. Wave. Hi. <laughs> come on, let's go. <laughs> The baby's going to be so lost when we got, go home because she's been so used to doing loads of adventures. She's walked loads, hasn't she, this holiday? Yeah. Like, I'm literally good. walked the legs off herself. I'm absolutely surprised how Look, great she is at walking. For the last time. All the others used to cry to get out the pram. But then when they got out of the pram, they didn't want to um, walk. walk yet. They'd, they'd want to carry or they'd just throw themselves. She just walks. She's really, really good. She only asks for the carry when she gets tired. And then you pick her up and then there you go again. She's back to being oh, walking again. Well, I've never seen a glittery car. What was it, a Bentley? It's a black glitter Bentley. And it wasn't like dirt or anything. It was actually glistening with glitter. 
whoever owns that must have a lot of money a lot a lot of money i want a glisten and glitter car <laughs> what do you think kate do you reckon i'll be able to buy one off the internet for a thousand pounds and then just throw some that's glitter it. all we'll over it we'll gonna make a, we'll... i'm gonna make a glitter car and it won't cost me thousands of pounds we'll fab, <laughs> 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 You've not got the energy after your weekend. The arcade shut. Yeah. How does it? Let it that let that be your motivation. The arcade opens at half nine. You wanna get up? There we go. You don't need to be scared, you fall, you fall onto so soft ground. It's alright. Go on. Go on, Nay. And I'll swing one arm over. You stand behind her, so she, that's what she's scared of falling. Go on, one arm over. That's it. Now the next one. You gotta swing your body. Let go of her, Joe, so she can swing her body. Let go to the next one. Arm, arm over. Do your arm over. <laughs> she literally monkeys around you. Are you playing in your, what is it? A dinosaur, dragon? Your green monster. <laughs> Come on, Eb. Yeah, oh. Good attempt. Oh God, you're too tall for it. No wonder you're not scared, like, because you don't have to put your feet on the floor and you're the same height. Is that Bram? I've got no upper body strength, so I've no chance to pull me back out. <laughs> you can do this, Nay. Nay, Nay, Nay. Do you remember yesterday when you said that you couldn't do the fair rides and then you did it because you are brave? Go on, let's do it. Well, what's up? You want out? Or do you want a rock? Like this, Rick. That's it. Rock, rock. Keep rocking. Yeah. I'm going to do it, Dad. Spot as big as me. The cute bunny just gets a pill. The spot is too big for me. Hey, have we got it? Yeah, she's floating in the air. Our <laughs> oh, Ebony's just really brave, isn't she? Like, she's got no fear. He's both brave, but Ebony's just gone that step further with the no fear level. Are you going on this one? Are you going on the horsey? Do you want to go on this one? Yeah. Yeah. Oh, Ebony? Yeah. Ready? Yeah. Mon no. no more monkey bars, eh? Way, she twisted her ankle. All yeah, the monkey bars. Yeah. Well, <laughs> well, when you fall off onto the floor, you do, don't you? Because it's like impact. Oh, you got mud all over your arm, Eb. Just give your arm a little wipe. Yeah. 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 yeah, go on. Show us what you learned in gymnastics. <laughs> you are my little mixer. <laughs> she wants to go in the swing, Jam. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Woo! Super smart. Can you use that one, or is that one too big for you? Is it? Come on. You definitely didn't learn that in gymnastics. You definitely didn't okay, learn that. Okay. Just be careful. We don't need another injury. Oh. 
cool. He's gonna to attempt to do it, this. <laughs> what did he do, Gibber? How did he do it? Oh, <laughs> now flip your body forwards. Oh, keep hold of the bar. Watch, she doesn't get hit. Go on, keep going, keep going. Keep going. Nevaeh, come here. Hold the baby so she doesn't get hit. Go on, flip your body forwards. Keep hold of the bar. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god! Oh, that was hilarious! <laughs> oh, I'm actually crying tears. Oh gosh, Joe, be careful! <laughs> Oh my god! <laughs> oh my god, go! Oh, my god, I thought it hurts too much for this laughing. Oh! <laughs> Are you on a big kiss swing? Oh no, now he goes down the slides. You ready? Three, two, one, go! <laughs> <laughs> uh, look at the butterfly that came to visit us. Where did I get it? Don't know if I got it. Well, that's not fair, is it? You're taller than them. So they should get a head start. Four up. As soon as they fall up. Go now. I won. Watch the baby. Watch out. No, don't get down a mini. Well, we've just got to call the minibus guys here and a little bit earlier than we expected. So, that's it. We're going home. I can't lie, I feel a little bit sad about it. Okay. I wish we did have a little bit longer. I'll show you this glitter Bentley now. Like, oh, can I, I don't even know if the camera's picking it up, can't tell. But how gorgeous is that? So nice. I want to get to my 27 foot living room. So I've got space for the seven of us. Yeah. Because... I didn't know how much I valued my living room until I was stuck in, the, stuck in these small spaces. So every holiday we always, we're always like on the first day, aren't we? Yeah. Should we just give our house up and move into a caravan? We could do that. And then we spend like three days in the caravan and we're like, no. And that's where I was eating. <laughs> <laughs> no, we need space. We need lots of space. I could do this with this kitchen worktop. Can you put a plate with the, down? With the one kitchen worktop. But yeah. Um, I mean, I'm a, I'm a little sad that it's time to go home because I feel like we're just starting yeah. the holiday. Yeah, you start getting comfortable and stuff. And you know, the area and the kids all start like, just starting to settle down instead of all the like, major excitement and stuff. But I am excited to get home to my own bed, see my doggy and my cat and start normal life again until the next time. And the crazy thing is, the next time we will be here, I'll be driving. That's mad <laughs> to think how much easier everything is going to be just because we'll have a car. Mad. Okay, signing out. Yeah, everything's all sorted. And mm. that's it, we're going. Say bye, caravan. Bye, caravan. Bye, bye. See you next year. Oh, you look really sad. Don't be sad. Remember, we had lots of lovely memories. Think if they tell you your friends will be over in two hours, you'll be able to play with them. And give them the gifts. Yeah, and tell them. And tell them about all the fun years. I can't come out. Look at each other. Yeah, for three. 16 weeks, we'll be back. Do it all again while we'll be driving as you.
Say bye bye, Holiday House. Yeah, one bit of sickness, didn't we? Uh, just as we got to the Zachary Hospital, she was like, I feel so sick. And we caught it in a bag, which was good. But it made you feel so much better, didn't it? The sickness all completely stopped. My dad is just left now. I think he'll be glad to go home. He not come and past us. No, he's not. Um, and we're just heading to the shop because we've got nothing in. No drinks, no washing up liquid left, no dog foods left. So we're just... Heading to our little corner shop to get some bits. Nevea is here. And then we could go home and start unpacking and doing the mountains of our mountains of washing. Now we're off to our shops. It feels criminal what? to be back, doesn't it? It feels nice, can't wait to get back and start. Do you think it feels nice to be back or yeah. do you think it feels like, oh, I wish we were still there doing something? No, it feels nice to be back. I'm, I'm still a little bit like, I wish we were still there. Still I always nice feel like that home. though. I always feel like, when we're there, I want extra days, but then when we've gone the seven days, it's been too much. So it, it doesn't work out right, yeah, does right. it? I, mean, I could have a house up there and live there. Yeah, maybe like a B home. Airbnb or something. But, I don't know, I like you could stay for a week if it was an Airbnb yeah, where there was. Yeah. I could live there if oh. I had my own home. Yeah. Like if I had my own couldn't space. live in a caravan, yeah. Like, like I couldn't live in that square foot. How do people travel for months yeah. and months on end? Do you think you just adapt to it eventually, kind like, of like? I could do that if I was travelling because you'd have an owner and everything else. You know? Yeah, I so suppose. You'd be able to break up the room and make it bigger. Yeah. But when you're all in that one living room at once. It's yeah, just... there wasn't enough room, was the Matthew You kept going to his bedroom because there wasn't enough room for us all. But it was nice if it was for me. Saying that, if your mum wasn't there, there would have been enough room for us all because yeah. there would have been space on the couch for Matthew then. But yeah, it wasn't enough for us all to sit in like. It was. I'm tired though. Really tired. I just feel like oh, I could sleep now. And your legs and your shoulders and your Yeah, that's my shoulders aching. I hope we aren't coming down with something. Yeah, nice. Or oh, COVID. COVID is raging in my arms at the minute. An English shower. Yeah, there was. It's not like rainy. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know, are you sure that we're in the tea tree body watch? I don't know. The pool was nice. I know that. The pool was one of the nicest we've been to. It was like this metal flag. You'd go down and then there'd be like a twist at the end. I am still was like twice. It was that good, like it was. It was really nice in there. I obviously didn't record in there, but I'll have like a little picture of what's on there and what it looks like in there because it was good. It was really good. We've just been speaking to the neighbour and she said Max looked really sad while we were away every time she's seen him out in the garden. He wasn't his usual self. And when my dad was going out of an evening time, he was crying. He was and he never ever makes up now. I got an alert on my blink camera of noise in the area. Um and when I listened to it, 
he was barking wasn't he but it stopped after a few minutes so I didn't think it was a continuous thing but she said he was crying quite a few times so I felt a, felt a little bit sly but yeah um, I think we're gonna see maybe if he can come with us next year or if he doesn't come with us next year tell me dad not to go out of an evening time and just stay with him all the time but when we talk Matthew with you what did he say I'm gonna be nearly 16 so can't I just stay with granddad and I was like, but I want you to come with us. But he was like, hmm, he, he weren't sure, was he? He said, I didn't really do much. I didn't really, didn't really play on anything. I really, really didn't do much. The arcades are too young for me now. It literally, we gave them, well, how much did we give them since Friday? About 50 pounds each. About 50 pounds each. And the boys have both come home with bags full of money because they've literally spent about a father on me. So, um, yeah. Matthew was like, I might want to stay at home. I'll decide closer to the time. I was like, I'll be driving, you know, so it'll be different. We can go out different places and, and like explore Wales because we'll have a car. And he was like, I'll see. So I've got a feeling he's not going to come, you know. There you go. But yeah, next May. So only a couple of months to go now. And we've got the excitement of Halloween and Christmas and everything else. Yeah, we've yeah when you've slept. We accidentally tripped and fell right into my <laughs> Honestly, this is going to be the nicest food we've had all weekend. Joe's starving, and let's be honest, we haven't ate much this weekend often because the food hasn't been great. We need to find a new solution of nice foods next time, or just cooking because. We spent a lot of money on food that was not nice and we didn't end up eating, did we? Oh, yes, I did. Mm. Yes, I feel so tired. He feels tired and he feels sick. I think he needs a little sugar rush. If you haven't drank much today, you'd have you. We got a grilled chicken wrap, it was a first, wasn't it? The best chicken wrap I've ever eaten in my life. It was, it was nice, wasn't it? Like, I haven't had a chicken wrap like that before, and it is really Didn't nice. Didn't get it stuck in my teeth, it was juicy. Much better than the um, I would be going with the grilled ones. again. Yeah. Only on the Caesar salad. Yeah, only on the Caesar salad. Right? We all got nice, nice Because Caesar the salad. sauce and the bacon, crispy bacon, complement it. But yeah, and you used our fruit bags, didn't you? Yeah, because we won Monopoly. Yeah, we did, we won on the Monopoly thing. But yeah, we're now we're just heading to go and get something for tonight's tea. Joe wants burgers. Homemade burgers, don't you? He said we'll get salad to oh, balance okay. out the badness. Come on. I was carrying the veil on my shoulders again. But Joe has had to run home because the guy who's coming to fit the new front door is outside measuring. So um, he took the baby and ran up home. And we've got the plan to push a bag of shopping. Makes sense, doesn't it? <laughs> But we're just taking a nice stroll while Ebony eats some more apples. You've got about three bags there to go through. <laughs> I know you do, you love all fruit, don't you? I feel like I've done more walking since we've been home than we've done on holiday. Back to the shop I go. You got stitched. We did show that, didn't we? Nose putty, I don't know where you got that from. But yeah, we are off the shop because I need baby milk. Didn't realise I was running out as I am. Um, we went around the town and everything earlier on and also we've just our, na our lovely neighbour we have a, a lovely neighbour up the top of the street her name's Joyce and her daughter Joanne um, they always get the girls little gifts and give them sweets and like when we weren't well with Covid they came down with cakes and stuff like that for us we've spoke about them before um, I keep getting distracted Ebony's gone to get a friend she hasn't seen her for ages and she's just got home from school so she's just gone to get her yeah so they, we've spoke about them on the vlog before they looked after us when we had covid the always get watch the car the car kids um we bought them two bars of rock and we've gone out to the shops left the two bars of rock on the windowsill and i'm like where's joyce and joanne's bar of rock searching everywhere for it and joe goes was it Everybody unicorn? Went. I said, yeah, um, it was unicorn. And uh, Max had only ate the both of them. So um, I'm just shooting the shop to get them something. 
A few hours have gone by since I last recorded. I think it was when I went to the shop with the girls. They brought their mate with us. Um, they gave their gifts to two of the friends. There's still one that's got to receive their bracelet yet. But she's not well at the moment, so they haven't been able to see her today. Um, I made homemade burgers for tea, as requested by Joe and the kids. And then Joe very kindly dished it out, because I just feel dead today. I'm so tired, I'm achy. I just think I need a decent couple of nights sleep to, like, revamp from the holiday. It's kind of like, like we've been on this never-ending adrenaline rush for weeks, because we were, like, getting the kitchen done, organising the christening, the christening, then it was the week... After the christening, it was like four days until the holiday. So we were packing and getting ready for the holiday. And then we've had the holiday and it just feels like now all the weeks have rolled into one. And we're at the end of September and we don't quite know where it all went. Where did it, where did it all go? And now we're home and it's just like, oh, we can relax a bit now. Although we are getting a new front door one day this week, which is great. Because that will stop the floor from getting destroyed off the leaky front door. And hopefully it'll make a massive difference come winter. Um, when we've got the heating on because it goes to like minus three by that front door with on the um, thermostat so hopefully that'll make a massive difference i'm not sure what we've recorded today i have tried to get as much in of our little you know getting home and whatever else and i'm sorry if it's been boring <laughs> thank you for watching i hope you enjoyed it if you did please give us a huge thumbs up subscribe and click the notification bell we upload new videos every tuesday thursday and sunday and we are back to normal now that the holiday and everything's out of the way see you again soon bye Six little